Hello everyone, this is Argon Matrix. Welcome to episode 2 of Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. I'll probably just say Super Mario RPG from here on out, because that's a long ass title name. Anyways, uh, let's go to Bowser's Keep. See if we can have a second crack at rescuing Toadstool here. Alright, yeah, Mario. Don't stop in front of the door and shriek in terror at the giant freaking sword in there. Hey, my name is Exor. Yes. Halt! Who goes there? A trespasser. This castle now belongs to us, the Smithy Gang. It's our first step to taking over this world. And if it were for nosy characters like you, we'd practically own this world. So let's see you deal with this. And he's going to flap his jaw at us. No! What are you doing? And how does that cause an earthquake somehow? What? It's a chain reaction. That's the definition of a chain reaction, you stupid Bowser. And Mario just looks this off into the distance of the castle, gets mad, and runs away. Ah, uh, Vista Hill. Let's check it out. Sure. Yep. Basically, whenever you come to this area, to Vista Hill, Mario just gets angry at the evil Bowser castle thing. And, uh, yeah. I'll go there one more time. When I first played through this game, actually, that, like, see that Bowser head that this castle is resting, resting on? That gave me, like, terrible nightmares. It was like, oh my god, it looks so scary and realistic. Ah. Of course, it doesn't scare me anymore, but whatever. Mario's pad. Can't just be his house, it has to be his pad, of course. His pipe house pad. Alright, hello, Toad. You're back so soon, did you forget something? No? What happened then? And Mario is going to float in midair and reenact everything. This game has a lot of random stuff in that. Like, Mario can shape shift and float in midair and stuff like that. You'll see, trust me. The Bridge to Bowser's Keep is out now? Just wonderful. We must inform the Chancellor of Mushroom Kingdom at once. Let's go, Mario. Let's go. Alright. But first, I'm going to sleep for no apparent reason. Weep. Yep. And also, um, by the way, I should note that. There are many secrets in this game, many of which drive some peeps insane. Um, yep. So, there's gonna be a l lot of, like, side questing and stuff in this game. Like, well, not necessarily side questing, just, like, secrets, hidden things that you would never know were there, or not for game facts, and what are you doing? Oops, excuse me. Oh. That bump in your head reduced your HP level. One of the Mushroom Kingdom's faced items ought to perk you right up. Received a mushroom. Sweet. Do you know how to use items? I have no idea. Of course I do. Duh. I just use the X button. Jeez. Oh, I see. You're just so well-traveled and experienced, Mario. Yeah, I am. Um, why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. Well, spit it out, you doofus. Oh my god, Goomba. Hack, I remember. I came to warn you that Mushroom Way is swarming with monsters. They're not monsters. They're freaking mushrooms with feet. I just barely made it out in one piece. Wow. You failed, Toad. Perhaps I can help. Do you know about timed hits, which is basically action commands that I explained in the last episode? And yes, I do. Hey, you better watch out. He knows about timed hits. I'm glad they don't, like, ask me forever. I was like, really? You know about timed hits? Are you sure? Uh, well, how about you just try it out just in case? And I'm like, no! Go away! Ah! He's got more bark than bite, huh? Yeah, pretty much. That's what it, that describes a Goomba 2 Uh, now, why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. That's right. We need to tell the Chancellor about Toadstool. I'll see you over at Mushroom Kingdom. Just in case, take these with you. And we got three mushrooms. Cool. But isn't this entire, like, land Mushroom Kingdom? I don't know. Maybe it just means, like, the actual kingdom itself, the castle. Alright, Mushroom Way. Very generic term for a starting place of a Mario game. Alright. So we've got a new enemy here. I'm basically gonna show off all the new enemies and stuff in this game. Or, yeah. These are just Goombas, pretty much. Stand typical in every Mario game ever. Yep, and you can block them so that they do zero damage if you do it perfectly. It's pretty cool. They actually have another attack where they like, shoot a pin at you or something, I don't know. Alright, and here we go. XP points to coins zero. Yeah, you get XP points and coins and everything. Um, yeah, I guess let's go over some more mechanics. If you press X out in the field, you access this menu. You can you can your items, self-explanatory status, um, it's basically all your stats and everything, attack, defense, magic attack, magic defense, XP level, and next left next level at 14 experience. So, okay. Um, yeah, and special, there's all our things. Mario learns a new technique at level 3, it says that in the bottom left hand corner there. So obviously we're going to want to get a level 3 pretty soon here. Right, equips, um, nothing yet. 
and special items, nothing yet. Those are basically key items that just come to play through the entire game. Uh, yeah. And by the way, hold down the Y button to run. Yep. Alright, I'm gonna just check out this battle. Let's see what's here. Ooh, two Goombas. Yep. I'm probably gonna actually start cutting out these... Oh, I forgot to block. Whatever. Start cutting out these battles pretty soon since it's basically just gonna be me punching Goombas over and over again. So unless I encounter a new enemy or something, then, um... Then I'm just gonna cut it out. Alright, awesome. Alright, that was cool. Um, I'm just gonna... No, I'll fight him. I need all the experience I can get. Yeah, I don't want to get into too many, too many random battles, because that means just more cutting for me and stuff, but yeah. Oh, coin block, cool. And, oh, new enemy. Let's check it out. Um, these are... Sky Troopers. No, they're Paratroopers. Stupid. Jeez. Anyways, as you can see, they have massive defenses. Um, so you're, you're gonna want to... Uh, you're, you can either just keep on hitting them over and over again, just like this, um... Take two hits, not too bad. Or if you really wanted to put dispose of them quickly, press the Y button and use your jump. And um basically action command. Oh, 93 damage. Damn, they're really weak to that. Oh, and we got an item from that, a mushroom, cool. And we got some coinage too. But yeah, basically um the action command for the jump, when you first land on the enemy, I think press Y and it'll make the do -do 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 sound that it did for me. And yeah. All right, Sky Troopa, sure, why not? Oh, just one? Okay, never mind. I'll just leave this in, I guess. Just punch it to death, whatever. Yeah. Oh, you missed. Fail. All right. Uh, something I'm, my, something else I should explain, um, well, I think it actually happened in the first battle, but I never, I didn't really talk about it at all. Um, there's, like, random flowers that'll pop out of enemies in battle and stuff, and, uh, I'll explain each of those when I come to them. Um, the first one I got in the first battle, I know this is kind of late to be explaining this, but whatever. It's, I need to explain it. But it said HP max above me. Basically, it's self-explanatory. Returns your HP to maximum level. Hallelujah. Alright. Uh, looks like a Goomba is keeping Toad hostage, so let's save him. Yeah, first boss battle. Hell yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, these are just standard Goombas. Nothing different about them. Jeez, I'm down to 8 HP. Crap. And we win. Alright, so I need to level up here soon. Phew, my life was flashing before my eyes for a second there. Dude, it was two Goombas. Could you not deal with that yourself? Here's a little something in return. And you get a honey syrup. That uh, restores like 10 FP or something, so... Yep, we're going to be consuming FP quite a lot throughout this game, so it's going to be pretty useful. Alright, oh my god, no. Almost ambushed by a Goomba there, but I'm going to fight him anyways. Alright, there was the flower, by the way. Damn it. Alright, so we're back now. Um, What the hell is this Goomba do? Oh, avoid you. Um, I guess we'll fight this Goomba to gain control of this flower. Because you actually do need this flower to continue through the area, I think. Well, not really, I don't think, but... Actually, maybe you... I'm not sure. I haven't played this game in forever, like I said. Ah, uh, yeah. And also, like I said, first few episodes, rather boring. Though I shouldn't talk. I shouldn't talk about how boring they are. That just makes them more boring. Put the accent on the O oh, and boring. You know, oh, level up, sweet. Mario reaches level two. Ah, uh, yeah. And here's how level up works in this game. Um, you get boost each stat when you level up, like all the stats that I showed in the status screen. But um, now you can. Like in this screen, you can ch either choose to get a bonus, a boost, and like an extra boost, if you will, in your level up to either your attack, your hit points, or your special attack, like your magic attack. Um, I like to start with special attack, then go to the physical attack, and then go to HP, and then just keep on repeating that cycle, you know? Alright, so we're just gonna go with special attack here. Sweet. Actually, it's special attack and special defense. Oh, what the hell? Oh no! Sky Troopa! Whatever, I'll just dispose of you with a jump. We but 90 damage. More than enough, definitely. Overkill. Alright, so when you're on this flower, um, once you're facing the way you want to jump, then jump off. I said jump off like that. And you'll jump rather far and high in that direction. Um, what that was, that was a flower. 
I believe that completely restores all of your FP. So, that's kind of cool. Let's jump over here on nothing. Oh god, Goomba. Alright, dispose of that guy rather quickly. Um, by the way, I'm just- oh crap. Okay, I was just trying to say, do you want me to cut out all the random battles, or just leave some of them in? Because, like, I don't know. Cutting a lot, it's not very not good in an, R in an LP, but in an RPG, I don't know. It's basically a lot- a lot of the time, it's just the same battle over and over again. Uh, like, you've seen this exact battle right here, just, you've seen it before, except I did 90 damage instead, and did 92 this time. I got an item, a mushroom, sweet. Boy, that was a close call. Here's a token of my appreciation. And we get a flower tab, um, yeah, before I explain that, what that, what that does, just tell, tell me, like, in a comment or whatever, what do you think about how much I cut out random battles. If you want me to leave them all in, then I could do that, but that would take a long time for the LP to complete. If you want me to cut them all out, I can do that, and it's just more work for me, but I don't mind, really. Ah, uh, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and check our items here. Um, we got our mushrooms, honey syrup, and the flower tab. Raises flower points by one. So if you use that, you, um, you can actually restore all of your FP and raise your maximum FP level by one, just like I did there. So I just like to use those pretty much right when I get them. I don't like to conserve them or anything. Or, oh god! Okay, sweet. Alright. I think we're gonna encounter some new enemies in this area so I can leave battles in. Yay! Okay, here's the first new enemy. Um, well, there's a Sky Trooper with him, but this is a Spiky. Just dealt with him in one swift punch there. Sweet. Alright, I'm just gonna kill the Sky Trooper now. Yeah, those guys aren't too hard, and despite the spikiness of them, you can still jump on them, unlike in most Mario games where if you jump on something spiky, you will get hurt. It will be very painful, and oh god. I'll leave this in. Why not? Show what the spikies can do, maybe? Let's see. Yep. Oh, yeah, see? They shoot, like, a pin at you. The Goombas can do that, too, actually. Basically, right when it hits you is when you want to block. So, yeah. Okay, and it still does three damage even when I block. Jeez. One powerful bastard you are. Okay, we're done there. Honey syrup, sweet. Right, um, yeah, so we're gonna avoid you. Let's see. I kind of want to get up to level 3, so I might grind a little bit here. I won't show that, of course, but... Okay, uh, I think... I, no, I don't think you can actually, like, jump high enough to fight the Lakitu here. I know you can fight Lakitus later in the game, but... Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and grind up to level 3 here off-screen. Um, doing a lot of stuff off-screen in this LP. I guess that's to be expected in an RPG, maybe. This wasn't such a good idea. Or, no, it was. Trust me, this game is awesome. You will love it when we get into the later episodes. Okay, so see you in a second. Alright guys, I decided to cut back in here just because I'm pretty much one fight from leveling up, so might as well show it. Why not, really? Seriously? Yeah. Block you, Sky Trooper. And BAM! Falcon Punch! It was only a matter of time before I made that reference. Level up, Mario reaches level 3, and... Stats? He owns Fire Orb. Um, that can be a quite, quite a useful technique, actually. I'll show it off eventually. Alright. And let's move on now. Okay, what's over here? Um, yeah, and yes, already in episode 2, the tediousness of grinding and cutting out battles and everything has begun. Hey, are you looking at me? My hammer and I don't like you. Mario, you better be careful. He's definitely got a mean streak. Well, screw him. I'm gonna take him on. Now you got my hammer angry. You shouldn't have done that. You shouldn't have done that, partner. This is pretty much the first boss against the Hammer Brothers. Cool. Alright, so... Hit you. He's gonna hit us with his hammer. And he's gonna hit us with his hammer. Right when, basically right when you get hit with the hammer is when you want to block it. Or press A to block it. Um, I'll show a fire orb now, why not? I'll use it on you. Okay, basically, here's the action command. Hit Y repeatedly. That's all you gotta do. So I'm spamming the button right now, you can probably hear that in the background. So yeah. Just keep on blocking these guys, they each do one damage. Oh, that guy did zero damage, wow. Just keep on punching them, and oh, he's dead, wow, that was easy. Alright, there's one more of them. Where did the other guy come from? Valor up. Oh yeah, Valor up. They, these guys can use two techniques, Valor up and Vigor up. Valor up raises their defense, Vigor up raises their offense, so be wary of those. But, I just beat them anyways. 
and looks like we're pretty much out of time here you guys um let's see what we get for this flower jar that raises our fp by i think three when you use it just like kind of like a flower tab but better all right so um yes thank you everyone for watching in the next episode we'll do more stuff this is argon matrix signing out thank you and good night